Yeah, praise to the most high even win, man, on uh, this good Friday. We thank you, God, for a beautiful day, nice weather. Amen. Amen. And uh, we still out here on the block, see if we can make something happen, man. Been real slow out here today, man. But uh, you know what really made me think about coming on here making this video because uh, I actually sat on this phone today and cracked the screen. So, you know, it might not be the best quality, right, but uh, still functional, right? So we want to get God the glory and let it be known that I got a brand new phone at the house. I got to do the potato chip out of this one and put it in another. So stay tuned. We'll be back on in a minute, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, Good Friday, you know, all these holidays, man-made holidays, what it really represents is the day that my Savior, the Messiah, Yahshua, the only begotten Son of God, he died on, on this day, about the ninth hour. But uh, this is the day that all the pain took place. Uh, the suffering, the stripes that he bared, the disrespect that's being spit on, carrying the cross, you know, all this being nailed to the cross. He did that for our sins as a punishment for, for mankind. So I'm grateful that my God is a great, all powerful God that can take the, the sins of man upon his own back and, uh, make a way for me to have eternal life and salvation through his sacrifice. Uh, you know, I shot a nail through my hand back in 1991 at the Georgia Pallet Company I used to work at, rebuilding pallets. The, the, I had one of those air guns. It went straight through my hand, went straight through the bone. It was one of them twist uh, nails too, so you know, so it went straight through, it came out the other side, and I actually nailed my hand to a 40-inch board that I was nailing on the pallet. And so I was able to get the board off, but I wasn't able to, I mean, get the, get, get, get the board off the pallet, but I wasn't able to get the board off my hand, so I go to the hospital. Anyways, they winded up putting me on the anesthesia and all that, then took it out. Of course, it broke my hand, but it went all the way through my hand. And, uh, it was very painful. And when I went in the emergency room in the hospital, I had got a ride there with one of my co-workers. I was a big guy, I was sweating, it was hot. It was in College Park, summertime, I'm in the pallet yard, you know, working hard. So when I walked in the hospital with that board attached to my hand, it scared the, you know, the staff, the little ladies at the reception there. They said, why you got that board? They thought I was like some crazed maniac finna come in there and start hitting folks upside the head. I was like, no, nah, I got this board nailed to my hand because uh, I can't let it go. It's nailed there, and I showed them the nail. You might can see that little scar right there on my hand right there. And uh, that's where it went all the way through. So, a little bit of the pain that my Savior endured on what they call a Good Friday in 2023. I can identify with because it was painful enough. You know what I mean? So he went through a lot worse than that. You know, so we just need to recognize that that's the kind of love that you can't really explain, but that's that's gopy love. Because uh, it's easy to love your friends, man, and people that you know like you or they tolerate you even. It's, it's easy to love them, okay? But when you love everybody enough, it's saying, the Bible say there's no greater love than this for one to lay down his life for his friends. Oh, what a friend we have in Yahshua, bro. A friend that stick closer than any brother. God bless you on this beginning of the Sabbath and the Passover this evening. Ah, thank you, Father, for giving us a perfect sacrifice. Making atonement for all the sin from Adam on down. Father God, thank you for giving us a way out. Uh, thank you for this phone, this recording device, that I can make this video and share your love with the world. 
Cause God love you, so do I. More love, more power, man. We out.